Hello and welcome to my first episode of Hardcore Iron Man Current Only series. I got this idea from some YouTubers named Settled as well as Verf. I'll be putting their channels in the description below. Um, they currently use Ultimate Iron Man accounts on their channels, but I feel like that's a little bit limiting and kind of boring to an extent, so I made this account to a Hardcore Iron Man so I could pick items. Um, the rules to this account are obviously I can only use Karen and train on everything else on, on Karen only. Um, I will be dr doing Druidic Ritual possibly on this account. That is the only thing that might be uh, not on Karen, but I'm going to weigh my options out and see how that goes. And uh, if, if that's okay with everybody, um, I will be doing that in the future. But for now, I'm just going to hold off on it. But my goals on this account are to do raids, to get a Dragon Warhammer, and to max this account as much as I can. And have some fun with it, you know? So, hope you guys do enjoy. Let's get it going. Okay, so now that we are at the docks of Port Sarim, um, we do have our member status, so that means we have an A-OK -okay to go into it. Let's talk to Vios real quick, and uh, let's get it started. Let's make our first journey. Our first and only journey on a boat. So now we are at Kurend, the Great Zaya. Um, there's so much that we can do actually, so I'm actually gonna be looking at some stuff and then uh, we'll get it we'll get it going. So if you guys do know I will be dropping everything that I obtained from um, my basic stuff. So I'll be dropping all of this stuff. All of this stuff I cannot use, so I'll be dropping every single one of it. Um, except obviously the armor and the uh, that's it pretty much. But I'll keep the sword just in case. But we do find a crossbow on the floor, so let's pick that up. So we have a nice little crossbow that we can use in the future. So that might uh that might actually be pretty uh useful. That's a pretty good find right in the beginning of the the start. So so this is actually funny. I've never seen this before. Robert Boss. <laughs> that is pretty funny. That is a good addition. Uh, Jagex, well played, well played, hundred percent. So I think the current goal for this uh, this account for right now is just to get the combat stats up. Currently, this is just literally a fresh account, so there's literally nothing on this. So um, I think our best option is to go to the cows. They're currently, I believe, in uh, I believe in Hosidius house. Um, I will be checking that up in just a bit. But yes, I'm going to go kill some cows, gain some XP, and uh, get some levels. So that way, if uh, I do come into something really scary... I can defend myself rather than getting one hit KO'd and then it being all over. So, so the first uh, walk into a city, so we get our nice little event. So we're going to do this real quick and see how it goes. Maybe we get some good XP. So with that random event done, we got level 7 fishing. That's really good, actually. So that was 660 experience, or 650, I should say. Um, so we gained six levels just from uh, doing a random event. So those are random events are gonna definitely be paying off. So that's really good. That's a good start to the good start to the Iron Man. But the reason why I'm uh, I'm training up combat, I believe, and I think it's the most efficient way possible. Also, I'm gonna pick up these cabbages so I can gain some uh, some good uh, food while I'm killing some cows. Is the reason is because I'm gonna be getting chasing armor eventually in the future. And in order to kill, in order to get the Shazian armor, I need to fight the uh, Shazian uh, fighters, the warriors. So I'm going to be needing to fight them, and they're kind of a high combat. So I think the most optimal gear that I could start out with is the Shazian. So I think that's the way to go. Now we're just going to pick up these uh, little cabbages here, and then we're going to start grinding on our cows. Well, try to get at least 20 in each. And then as soon as we get that, like 20 attack, 20 strength, 20 defense... We'll start doing Shazy in uh, favor, and then once that happens, we'll try to see how killing the um, fighters go. Okay, so now that we are at the cows, let's get this started. Let's get some good attack levels, and uh, we'll get it going. So We'll have some fun with this. <laughs> I'll tune back in every so, so many levels, and then uh, we'll see how that goes from there. All right, so we are currently here right now. Um, we did some cows over here. Uh, we've done as many as we can before. We actually got pretty low, so now we're just got our full inventory of uh, beef. Um, we were picking up some cabbages and some uh, onions over here. So they're, they were a nice little plus one, but let's see if we can get some uh, beef in so that way we can uh, get some food. Also, there is a bank over here that we can run all the way over here, bank some stuff. 
um, just in case we get overstocked with food. Maybe I'll bank the uh, the beef, the leftover beef that I have. Still grind out some cabbages and uh, onions and see how that goes. Currently, the stats that we got right now is just 9 attack, um, 11 HP. Um, we're currently going to be grinding this to 10. And as soon as we grind this to 10, we're going to be doing uh, strength and then going up from attack again, plus 5 levels probably, and then plus 5 with strength. And then keep on working our way up to 20, and then we're going to finally grind out our HP, so... Yeah, it's gonna be fun. Oh my god, thank god that guy, that dog cannot kill me. Also, once we get a bigger thieving level, I believe at level 25 is the level that you can start attacking, or start uh, doing these, so that's pretty good. But uh, once we get that out of the way, we'll start grabbing some fruits, fruits, and then uh, we can grab all this stuff just like this guy is, so that's pretty cool. Let's get started on the beef. Alright, so we've cooked our beef. Um, we got some good levels off that. We got six love, uh, five actuals actually. So all this cooked beef, I mean the burnt beef we will be dropping. So let's note this in real quick. Um, and then drop these, but we got some nice little meat. So those, those will be pretty useful in the future. 15 out of the 27 that we've gotten, we uh, cooked successfully. So that's pretty good. Not too bad, but we're going to go back to grinding out cows and, uh, see how that turns out. I currently missed it. <sighs> God damn it. I hit 10. 10 strength, so that's pretty good. Also, we did hit a nice little prayer level, so now we can actually use Burst of Strength, which increases our strength by 5%. So now we can start using that rather than the defense one, so we'll actually hit a little bit harder for the cows. Um, since we are automatically going to be running back and forth, um, there is a prayer altar right here, so I can just use this without any, uh, any worry whatsoever. So it'll start gaining up the... Uh, it kills pretty faster, so nice. All right, so we're about to hit our 10 combat or for attack. So there we go. That's our nice 10 attack. Um, we're going to actually move to our offensive for strength XP, so that's pretty cool. But yeah, have some fun with that. Now get some nice strength XP so that way we can start hitting twos. OP, OP. All right, so we got our next full inventory of cow meat, a bunch of beef, so that's pretty cool. Uh, we got some eight strength now, so now we're grinding up the gains. We, uh, we were pretty close to dying, but uh, we risked it, and we live another day. So let's grind this, uh, let's grind this meat, get some cooking levels, and keep on uh, rinse and repeat, you know? As I did say, um, as soon as I start getting some... Uh, combat levels up and whatnot. I'm going to be grinding out um Shazian favor. Currently I don't have anything with with anything whatsoever, so um we'll be grinding these out. Um uh, once we get the Shazian favor, as you can see, we're going to be doing Hold on, let me see. Sorry. Uh once we get into the Shazian favor, we can heal heal injured injured soldiers and then we can start building our favor up to get some Shazian armor, which I feel like would be the best option that we can have currently for uh optimal gear so we'll keep on grinding that and then uh until then we'll just be grinding out levels so okay so we got our next inventory of burnt meats ready and regular meats obviously so let's see how much we've gotten so far we got almost 30 so that's pretty good uh with our burnt meats obviously we're just going to throw them to the floor uh we're going to hold on to these for now though because um honestly the uh the cabbages and also the onions are holding pretty well for me so I'm always just going to be running back up here. Also, it's not that far, so I'd rather save our burnt me our meats and then uh, just use it from there. So I just run up here, grab some cabbages, and then just run over here again, and then go back to the, the cooking range, and then just keep on doing that over and over and over. Also, I can gain up my... Uh, I can use this altar, too, to uh, get some nice little prayer restoration. So not too bad, not too bad. All right, so our third inventory of uh, beef. I know this is pretty boring. I'm really sorry, but as soon as we get content rolling, we'll uh, start game make making some cool gains and uh, doing some more cool stuff. But for now, we're just grinding the uh, combat stats. We got 12 strength, 10 attack, 4 HP, 14. I mean, 14 HP, I'm sorry, and 4 prior, and as, as well as some uh, cooking as well. So as soon as we start grinding out these uh, levels, We'll be doing some bandages, doing again some chasing favor, and then that will be translating into some chasing armor. So 
I know this is boring, I'm really sorry, but we'll get through it, I promise. All right, so we've thrown some more cooked meat in there. We've got our 48 cooked meat. That's not bad. That's a good little kickstarter to uh, the food grind. But for now, um, we're just grinding out some uh, levels still. we still got a little ways to go, but for now, that's, that's, that's pretty good, you know? All right, this will finally end up the episode one of the series. Thank you all for so watching. I really do appreciate it. And I'm sorry it's really slow right now, but we will get grinding soon enough. Um, be sure to like it if you did enjoy the video, and please give feedback to this being my first actual video I've ever done. Um, thank you guys so much, and have a great day.